Hey, what's up? This is Atlas Knight, and today I'm up over here at uh, Video Game Trading Post. They got some more uh, new Nintendo Switch games in, so I'm going to go ahead and show y'all. Here's the outside of the store real quick. And here's their store hours. I don't know if you can see her, and I was a lot of blinking. Anyway, let me, let me go ahead and go up in here. They have some of these machines right here. Uh, I think they're called uh, Gacha machines. I've seen these before uh, on a YouTuber's channel. I forget his name. But anyway, I'm not gonna do, I'm not gonna record the whole um, inside the store like last time. I'm just gonna record the uh, Nintendo Switch games. They got a couple of new ones in. I guess more I Nintendo Switch games down here. Uh, Red 11 North Palafox, which is close to one of the cathedrals downtown. as a starting point, and then we also have it at um, $2.99 if it's like boxed new. We have like the, the one that comes red and blue joy cons. We also have the Animal Crossing one for the same Oh price. yeah, let me show some more games. I forgot, they got Nintendo Switch Indeed. games over here. At first when I saw this, I thought this was um, the Saga 4, but the Saga 5 I already have that one. I kind of wish I would have bought that in the Sega 4 a little bit earlier. I think the cheapest price I've seen before anywhere has been about $79. That was on eBay. Man, well, hopefully Nintendo keeps it up and keep these games uncensored. Huh, what's this? Oh, no, never mind. That's PS Vita. Oh, they got Valkyrie's profile. I got that same game on PSP. I got the physical copy. <laughs> They got some Silent Hill games here. I know I said I was just going to show Nintendo Switch games, but, um, well, pretty much show all the Nintendo Switch games. Man, really, that's really like the main reason why I like Nintendo Switch and keep their games uh, uncensored. Well, excluding Final Fantasy VII Crisis Core, I hated that they censored Tifa's costume and stuff and her body. I kind of actually hate that censorship. Because once that starts, it's going to start censoring everything else. Most people wouldn't understand it unless you're a hardcore gamer. But, um, yeah, it's just like, next thing you know, they say, okay, let's censor this. Next thing you know, they're going to censor the whole game. Take out a whole bunch of stuff. Like, what's next? 
replace Barrett Sorum with a uh, what's it called? Flower sprinkler? Because his gun's offensive on his arm. But I mean, well, FS don't get me wrong, Final Fantasy VII Crisis Core is still a good game. I still like it though. Don't get me wrong, I just don't like censorship. I used to own some of these games like back when I was younger. Hopefully some of them get remastered again on the uh, Nintendo Switch. Um, no, it's got like a bunch of different names at the end. Like XORC, XOREST1, XOR, you know, Dumb letters. Yeah, I just really like that game Man, the crazy awesome. thing is, I used to own a lot of these games back when I was younger. If I know how much they're going to be worth, I would have kept them. Well, I'm older now, so I'm more wiser. I just buy video games. I don't sell them unless I find an extra copy out of a pawn shop. Oh yeah, that's right. Let me show the PlayStation uh, One games. I completely forgot about that. Huh? It's all Lunar Two's worth. One hundred twenty-five dollars. I thought it'd be a, worth a little bit more than that, but I'm not sure. But it's an okay game. It's just a little bit too hard. They need a difficulty setting on there. But hopefully, I hope that gets remastered for the Nintendo Switch as well. Nintendo needs to hurry up and release a Nintendo Switch Pro 4K. Like, when it's docked, give it 4K Ultra. No, give it 4K Ultra High Definition, 60 frames per second. When it's in dock mode, and then when it's portable, give it 1440p, 60 frames per second. And then upgrade the battery. What's up? To give it a longer look? battery life. Man, it's giving me issues. No, man, look. So it went, it loads and it plays for about five minutes, then it just goes off. I mean, every time, man, it just keeps going off. Okay. No other games doing that, man? No, but I was, man, I don't want this game, dude. What's wrong, dog? Return it. What's wrong, man? You want to get I got that game right there, too, the one with Chrono Trigger on it. I just don't have the cover art for it, but I do got the physical copy of Chrono Trigger on PS1. I can I can exchange it for another game, but I, I can't do cash. What other games do you? We got tons, man. <laughs> I'm gonna keep the game here, and I'm gonna I'm gonna test out this Donkey Kong. Let's see. Here. Right. Well, just take just take me a moment. Yeah. And they got some statues up here too. I like these. I know Matt would probably love to buy these. And they got some uh, more models down here. I don't know what people call them. I'm, they're not toys. I, I'll just call them models. But they look good. Reset my movie. Why? Angry. And let's see. Am I missing anything else here? Oh, they got PS Vitas. But anyway, uh, my recording time limit's almost up. I don't know why. Whenever I record in 4K on the cell phone, it only lets me record for 10 minutes. So I don't know how to change that. I'll just show these one more time. And make sure you subscribe to my YouTube channel, uh, Atlas Nights. And make sure you like this video. I mean, there's stuff on that Mario Kart 64, man. I couldn't get them off of it. And now I bought it with the Super Nintendo. Still, I can't This is a it. very good racing game. It's, it's a lot faster and smoother than Mario Kart. And you'd still have, you know, let's see, the mines. You still have 25 to play with. You can get another game. Or you can keep that store credit on your name for another time. Let's say if you guys need another controller or a game called the 64 or something. 